I just say that I have a very long and positive discussion with the President. I mentioned to him the importance of reaching a ceasefire and uh, to continue the peace process in spite of all the difficulties. The President will give another point of view, which is not very different from my point of view. I'm afraid that it's a bit different. <laughs> yes, I know. Dakle, ja sam general sekretara upoznao s time da se na stolu nalaze naš, naš peace plan, kontakt grupe koji još uvijek na snazi, dalje da se nalazi naša ponuda za prekid vatre u Bihaću i za prekid vatre u Bosni i Hercegovini na tri mjeseca dana, kao i sve rezolucije Saveta bezbjednosti. Mi, mi smo predložili, sugerirali generalnom sekretaru da od druge strane traži prihvatanje ovih dokumenata. My purpose, my purpose in coming here was not to enter into the tails negotiation, but to convey to both sides a simple message. That message is that if they want to retain the assistance and support of the United Nations, in bringing this terrible war to an end, they must do two things. First, they must show a readiness to negotiate and work in good faith to find a common ground. Secondly, they must cooperate with UNPROFOR and the High Commissioner of Refugees. I have invited Dr. Karadzic to meet me at the airport this afternoon so that I could have a similar discussion with him. I have to express my deep disappointment and surprise that he declined my invitation and that it has not therefore been possible for me to convey my message to him personally nor have I had the opportunity to press him to lift the restrictions he is currently placing on the movement of the United Nations personnel and convoys, including the resupply of the Bangladeshi battalion in Bihar.